Okay, I thought we would just look at a couple of in-hand card flips that's kind of nice to do. It adds just a touch of flair to your performance uh, without uh, being overly showy, okay? So one is, if you can see what I'm doing, I'm just pushing off one card. And then I'm going to take it like this. Okay, and you just... I mean, even practicing that, I guess maybe it'd be good to work up to certain things, but so just pull it off, set it down. So you get to the point where you can just pull them off. Maybe I'll do it more slowly. So you go like this. And then on the back, what's happening is your middle finger is catching the back and then your index finger is holding the front. Okay, like that. So it's just a way to kind of show the cards and reveal them. So you really only need two fingers for it. Okay, so your middle finger on the back, your index finger on the front. Now once it's there, it's you can do flips. And it's here I suppose maybe more than one uh, finger is being employed just for support. So, okay, so we just, um, so there we go, like that. And then what you're doing is with your thumb, you're flipping it. Okay, and then you're you know readjusting your grip there. Okay, so there, so, you know, index on top, middle on the other side, and then you just flip it. And you know, if you do it fast enough, it causes a fun little snap. And as I've mentioned before, um, adding little noises to the card movement, especially for like the big reveal, you know, like they're, they're going to be really surprised by the identity of that card because you've just, you've put it through just so much, you know. And you may have, you may have seen what I did where I flipped it like this and then, oh, that's cool. That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> this, and then you can do the same thing here with your left hand. So, you know, if you, if you flip it and now it's down and now you want it, you know, back up, you can, you know, adjust that. Okay, so however you want to, I think this is probably how I do it normally. I just kind of set that down because if I do one flip, it's still, <laughs> it's still face down, <laughs> right? So, you know, just play with that, you know, get your left and right hand working. Now, all of this will depend a little bit on if you're left-handed or right-handed as to which, uh, which is your dominant hand doing, uh, holding the deck, let's say, okay? So you can kind of just see how it feeds it to the other one and sets it down. So it just kind of gives it a fun little tw twirl. Another way that's fun as well, um, though I, th I think this will probably take more practice, I honestly don't remember when I learned this actually, but, and I include the little flip there, I guess, but, um, so here, this is a one finger turnover. Okay, so let's slow that down. So I'm going like, see how my fingers are there? And then it's between, now it's between your middle finger and your ring finger. And then you just flip it and then you can flip it over if you like from there. Okay, so it's kind of hard to show here on the side. So we go like this, and then you can let it flip up, and then your thumb kind of takes it. Okay, I'll just show this a few times. It's almost like your fingers are, are um, your middle finger and your ring finger are kind of sliding past each other causing that, causing that rotation, okay? You can have it, you can just leave it on top if you like and then turn it back down. You know, if it was like a, just a single reveal, it's like, okay, well, let's just check to see what the top card is. It's that, very good, let's put it back. Okay, I did a different little flip to put it back, but. Okay, so there you go. It really, it's, it's just the middle and the ring finger that are doing the work. And then the thumb comes over here and grabs it with your index finger. So I guess I should point that out. Your index finger is kind of catching it as well. So it's being, it's 
being so there the, the twist has happened. Now your thumb's going to come over, thumbs up here, index finger is going to come over here, and then take the card. The other two fingers are given a break. So now your thumb and index will take it from there. Okay, and it, it's it's obviously a knacky thing again where. You just, you try it at first, the cards go everywhere. Oops, I did an extra little flip. <laughs> you, you can tell it's muscle memory because I'll add things on it that I'm not meaning to add, but my silly fingers remember to do such and such. And so they do it without kind of me explicitly telling them. So you rotate it and then grab the thumb there index finger there and then you can set it down. Thumb there, index finger, and then you can let it off with a flick, flip if you like. And I don't know if you kind of saw what I saw what I did where you can almost see this finger, these fingers kind of like, you know, shoot off as they're fl flipping it like that. So uh, anyway, that's a, that's a fun uh, one-handed uh, turnover, and then once you get in that position, you turn it over, put it in your other hand, finish the job, or whatever you want to do. Okay, great. So th those are a couple of um, single card flips that are nice. It's nice to have at least one that you do that's unusual, that gives a little bit of an exclamation mark on a card that you're now going to reveal. So, um, so I hope that's helpful.